Welcome back to the channel. Today is a day for R&B. So for today's tutorial, we're gonna be making an R&B beat from scratch. Let's go. I got this chord progression that I was working on earlier. It's a basic two, five, one chord progression. I'm gonna break this down and show you how you can build it step by step. But first, let's listen to it. So the sound we're using is from my Purple Skies Analog Lab Bank. This is perfect for R&B and Trap Soul. Purple Skies is my second R&B Trap Soul released kit. This is also perfect for like smooth West Coast beats, 70 presets in here. Let's go ahead and deconstruct this chord progression and build it from scratch. This you can start off in a major scale if you wanna build this out and replicate it. So we'll go over here, as you can see, we are in C major for this. And I'm gonna build out a chord on the one because we're gonna be doing a two, five, one. So it starts off on the one of the scale. We're in C major, so it's C right here. We're gonna build out a major seven chord so we skip a note here place skip here place skip place this is the c major seventh chord in the key of c major so this is going to play out for about a bar and a half so we're going to shorten this here and then it's going to play again right here it's just going to hit twice before a chord change comes so the next chord that i built out right here is the b minor seventh chord but you'll see that this note right here is not inside the scale. We do need to go outside of the scale sometimes for R&B to really get that R&B sound. You'll see it a lot in jazz as well, soulful music. You just get a lot of notes that are outside the scale. So let's build out this second chord right here, and I'll show you how we could do this. So we start on B. If we're keeping it in the scale, skip a note, place, skip, place, skip, place. This is the original chord, right? This is a diminished chord right here. So what I did was take the fifth of the chord, root, third, and fifth, the fifth right here, and I sharpened it. And it just sounds really good when it plays down like this. And then we're just gonna hit that simple two five back to the one, which is real basic. So to build out a two five one, you just need to build chords on the two and the five of the scale. So we have the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, back to the one right here of C. So the two is gonna be D, so we'll take that. And then three, four, and five is gonna be G. So that's the fifth. So then we have the two, and the five, we just bring these in. Now I'm gonna build out a chord right here. So skip a note here, place, skip a note here, place, skip one here, place. And then over here we do the same thing, skip, place, skip, place, skip, place. This is gonna be like the basic form of it, going from the two. That's that two, five, one, right? We can make this sound a little bit better if we were to take things and drop it down like this. Now we get something that sounds like this. So we have the D minor seventh right here, right? What I did was actually take this C and I flattened it. Then what I did is take both these root notes right here and I drop them down an octave. So control down arrow like that. And then what I did was take this, bring it up one octave here. So it's just an octave of the bass. And then this chord right here, I just duplicate over here. So I'm playing the same chord here and here, but different root notes right there. And then I go over here, take this, and drag these all down one octave like that. And then we start to get a chord progression that sounds like this. If you wanna have some more emotion to this, instead of this going up, what we're gonna do is let this go from B up to D. And then this G right here, we actually drop it an octave here. This is just gonna give a little bit more emotion at the end because it drops down. All right. Now we have that same chord progression. All right, now I wanna find a path for this. So I'm back inside the Purple Skies Analog Lab Bank. I'm gonna just go ahead and hit one of these pads real quick. Ooh. Pad Indigo goes crazy. Let's go ahead and duplicate it. I wanna get one more pad that has a little bit more sustain to it. So we got the Owls pad right here layered in. It's one of my favorite pads from the bank. Just kinda of have that tucked in the back. Then let's go to the keys. I want to get rid of some of this low end. I want to add a reverb to it as well. All right, next thing we got to add is a bass. I got bass reflective pulled up right here. One of my favorite basses from here because it just has like a realistic feel to it. I'm gonna just freestyle this bass on the keyboard. We are in C major, so it's all the white keys right here. And then I'll explain what I did after, but let's just get some type of bass locked in for this. Ooh. 
but we have our root notes playing right and i just have like a bouncy feel going for this when you kind of have like a bouncy rhythm going and spaces in between it gets a little bit easier to add in these green notes right here like these accent notes that are kind of moving so if you pay close attention i'm staying on my root note right then i go up one note from the root note so from c to d back down to the root note then I hit my next root note being B. Before I go up to the third root note over here, I drop down one note in the scale from B to A. So it's the same thing I did from here to here. Then I hit the next root note, space, drop down one note to C. And then I do do a pretty big drop down to G right here. Just felt good, so I played it and I do like how that sounds. What I think I wanna do is actually pitch this whole thing, kind of like F sharp. So all I need to do is take all these right here, go over here to transpose. I need to go down by six semitones there. See what this sounds like. Hold on. That's fire. Why I like this too is because maybe later I want to export this out and pitch the whole thing up like pretty high to get like a different sound for it and then go ahead and like relay that bass down a bit lower. I really like how this sounds right now. The next thing I want to do is add a lead. Hold on, 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 that might be it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's record that. Maybe something like that. Let me just freestyle. There's something at the end right there. I'm gonna just throw like the smallest amount of reverb on it. Let's do like a hmm, maybe a no a smooth plate, smooth plate. Let's go that boom, something like that. Yeah, that's clean. I like that a lot. All right, now what I want to do is pitch this whole thing. So I'm gonna render it out. I always just do it quick for tutorials, but I'll actually stem this out later. I want it to kind of sound sampled. A little bit higher. Ooh. Ooh. That's fire. Eight or nine? Let's try nine. I feel like nine is gonna be a seven or nine. Those are always like really good. Ooh. The lead needs to come down. That's, that's crazy. That's exactly what I want it to sound like. Like with some percussion. Kind of has. I'm gonna add like RC20 or something on this and then maybe a little bit of kickstart kind of have like a ducking sound to it and then a little bit of percussion just to kind of make it sound like it's a little bit of a sample because that's the vibe i'm getting from this purple skies is the go-to bank for r&b and trap soul it contains 70 presets made from scratch and mixed to work right away containing things like arps basses bells guitars keys leads pads the list goes on this bank will give you the r&b sound you need for your production with 70 presets to choose from you have so many options to create with there's also a free demo version of the bank you could try. Purple Skies is available now. Hit the link in the description to get it today. All right, so on the exported sample, I got RC20 on it. This is the setting right here. It's like an old preset I made from a long time ago. And then I put a little bit of hyper chorus. It's the first preset if you click over right when you open it. And I brought the mix down pretty low. Then we got kickstart on a quarter note, mixed down to like 15%. It just adds like a slight pumping that you don't really hear too much. Then a smooth operator. Then we got some EQ, just cutting out some lows, boosting a little highs, cutting out some of the low mids. And then a reverb. 
All right, so I got the bass notes right here duplicated in, and we do need to go up nine semitones because that's what we did with the sample. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then let's drop this down an octave. So control down arrow. So now we have that bass, same thing, but drop down an octave as the sample. Oh. So I duplicated the chords. I chose a pluck for this. This is the preset right here. And all I did was paste in the chords and do a reverse strum. So you can hit Alt S and then you just bring this down like that. And then that has some EQ, delay, reverb, a little bit of portal, and then another EQ on it. And then the other thing I did on the hi-hats, you could try this. Sometimes it sounds cool, especially for these types of beats. If I go over here to eight, you see that I do have a delay. These are my settings for it. You can copy these if you want. And then I have a little bit of portal on the hi-hat and it's just the default. It's kind of adding like a little bit of a stutter to it and then a tiny bit of reverb, which I don't do that much, but watch what this sounds like with both of these in. And without all the effects on the hi-hat, with especially on the rolls that you do it adds a nice touch to it I also forgot to mention completely forgot to mention that i brought this back up i brought it down to seven instead so we went down just by two semitones so let's hear the full thing now With that said, appreciate you watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this tutorial and were able to learn something from it. If you're interested in the Purple Skies Analog Lab Bank, there'll be a link to that in the description. As always, appreciate you guys watching. Till the next video, peace. <music>